Okay, so I, I'm joined by Sam again, and we are today playing some Kings of War Historical. So if you're not familiar with Kings of War Historical, um, it was a supplement book written by Alessio Cavatore, um, and yeah, it's not very uh, realistic, <laughs> so uh, not very historically accurate, shall we say, but basically what it did, it took the Kings of War uh, rule set, which is quite a solid rule set for rank and flank, um, and kind of turn it into like Hollywood history, I suppose, wasn't it? Yeah. Yeah, so basically you had a core master list, which was light infantry, heavy infantry, archers, etc. And then lots and lots of different um, sort of, I suppose, themed lists. So you'd have Spartans, you'd have Carthasians, Egyptians, so on and so forth. Um, and they would have specific um, units and characters, which would then add into the master list so obviously from those that are interested in historical gaming without counting the stitches and buttons it's probably a great way of just getting some historical games uh, played in your local club uh, or just between friends without really being too hung up on the historical side so um, I mean yeah, they think Gladiator, think Braveheart, that type of thing. Um, so we're going to lay down a age-old battle. Uh, yes. Sam is running the mighty Romans. Romans, okay. Um, and uh, I will be running the Barbarians, which Filthy. in this case are going to be Celts. Filthy Celts. Filthy Celts. Okay. So basically, uh, the Celts have uh, been fed up with the Roman rule. <laughs> Um, and they have moved on to uh, Roman held territory within Britannia and uh, as such this battle was taking place uh, near a main road heading towards the uh, Roman outpost uh, the, the watchtower, a small wood and some rocky ground but again because it's historical we don't want loads of terrain on the board at the end of the day uh, so we're just going to sort of rock it and see. Now with the historical list it did have the option to use the fantastical creatures so for example if you were playing Greeks you could have giants, you could have harpies, that type of thing. Um, for this we're, we're not going down that route however just to get the points up a little bit for the Celts um, I have thrown in two wizards which effectively uh, are going to be acting as uh, priests. Uh, they won't be doing any of the fireballs and stuff. Um, however, they do have heal and bane chant, which is the the two that I'll be using, and wind blast as well. Just a just magical. Just me back a bit. Yeah, magical, magical blast uh, without actually causing any damage because we don't really want fireballs flying across the board. Um, so other than that, we've got two and a half thousand points each, there or thereabouts. So I'm a little bit shy, I think 70 points shy of uh, Sam, which is negligible uh, when we're playing this size battle. Um, and uh, we'll show you the forces and uh, get the game going. Yeah. So if you enjoy it, uh, like and subscribe. And remember, we do have a Patreon as well, so the link's below. All right, thanks for watching and do comment if you enjoy what you see. So thanks for watching, bye bye. Okay, so here we have the uh, Roman force. If you want to run through what we've got. Yes, so we've got a regiment of Praetorian That's cavalry. surely a horde, isn't it? Regiment. Oh, yeah, it's a troop, isn't it? Five, yeah. Then we have a, a, horde, of King's Ward. <laughs> a horde of Triario. Yeah. A horde of heavy warriors. Yeah. Then we have a hero. Yeah. A eagle bearer. Yeah. A horde of normal warriors. Yeah. Behind them we have a regiment of Praetorian guard. Yeah. Then we have Julius Caesar. Okay, Maximus. That's what it says on there. Then we have a catapult. Yep. And then we have a regiment of Triario. Mm -hmm. A troop of Praetorian cavalry. Yep. Two small bulk throwers. Yep. And then we have another horde of Triarii and another regiment of Praetorian cavalry. Okay, and there is the Roman watchtower. <clears throat> so the attacking force. Okay. Of Celts. Big long line of Celts, <laughs> but not worth very much. So we've got seven regiments of uh, Celts, Celt warriors. We have a regiment and a troop of war dogs. Uh, we have three regiments of heavy cav. I think they're heavy cav or normal cavalry. They're not light anyway. Uh, we have three regiments of chariots. Uh, we have a troop and a regiment of fanatics. Okay, um, there's some more chariots over there. Uh, we have the two priests or druids. 
Um, we have a um, army general is mounted on a horse. Uh, again, just to boost the points, he has got um, some uh, famous armor, which effectively means he is defense six. Uh, the army standard bearer also has a bow. Um, again, just to bulk out some points, I was running out of men. Uh, <laughs> the uh, Carnix blower. He's specific to the uh, Barbarian list, and um, the and I think that's it. Oh no, I've got a hero. Yeah, you got another hero. Uh, hero's got Weapon Master, uh, so he's got Elite, so he effectively re-rolls ones. Okay, uh, the Romans obviously don't have any uh, upgrades other than that of uh, Julius Caesar. <laughs> and uh, we are going to start with a roll to see who goes first. Uh, a five for the Celts. Two. Okay, so the Celts will go first and they will uh, basically run at the Romans and bounce <laughs> off them, I guess. So uh, we'll see how that so. goes. Okay, so uh, with plenty of yells, the Celts have advanced forward. Um, no real shooting of any note. No, obviously, magic. Um, so uh, they have pushed forward near enough onto the halfway line. Uh, a few warriors getting stuck in the woods. Um, and that is over to the Romans. So uh, Roman turned one. Okay, so the Romans uh, had the choice or the decision to make, which was hold the line or advance in formation. They decided to advance in formation as they believe their armor and better training will uh, benefit the day. But also we are playing an invade scenario. So uh, points are scored for getting units in the other half so again sitting there and drawing the Celts on um, we'll wait and see whether that was the right decision so uh, into the Roman shooting phase yes. so uh, you got two bolt throwers or two bolt throwers pick a target um, they're both no they're not this one is going to shoot these dogs yep so two shots hit on five okay Negative. Second one's going to shoot the dogs. Yep. No. No. It's cr cracking. Well, fairly, she's trying to. <laughs> an oversized crossbow trying to shoot, shoot my uh, cockapoos. <laughs> <laughs> Catapult. Yeah. Is. Going. It's an honor, go by the Reading off the sheet. <laughs> It's technically they're not bold for those either. Scorpio. Scorpio even. Um, he's going to try and shoot these guys. Yep. Yeah. Hit on a five. Yep. Yeah. Good start so far. With uh, no Amazing. hits from shooting. That's it. That's, That's it. So that is got. the uh, complete end of turn one. Uh, just to recap, Celts have uh, all advanced and the Romans have all advanced bar their artillery which obviously fired. So into Celt turn two. Okay so a bit of a shuffle over here. Cavalry have uh, seen the threat of the uh, horde <laughs> and have moved around to try and take on the uh, artillery pieces uh, which unfortunately were about a centimetre out of charge range. Um, got a big charge happening in the middle. Uh, dogs and warriors. Uh, let's see if they can uh, not bounce off. On the other side We've got the brave dogs going in against the <laughs> Roman Traore and the chariots have charged the uh, the cab over there. Okay, so um, yeah, let's uh, pick this uh, battle up in a sec. Uh, so the uh, throwing weapons and sort of mixture of short bows and javelins from the chariots uh, failed to impact against the uh, Romans, doing one casualty, but their iron resolve has uh, ignored that. Um, the two druids have given the elixir of asterix uh, to the fanatics and to the chariots both of them giving bane chant which gives them an extra crushing one um, so we're into some combat so uh, we will get cracking in the middle over here okay so this first battle here is this blue unit of what are they triaria, triaria versus two units of warriors and dogs in the flank Okay, so the war dogs in the flank, it's only a troop, but we double their attacks. That gives us uh, 20 attacks for 6, 8, 
nine, ten. Three. Okay, so the dogs are hitting on fours. Um, so it's not too bad to be fair. No, it's not too bad. So we'll take those misses out of the way first. So it's like just a little bit above average. And they are vicious, so they're going to be re rolling ones. What's your defense? Five. Uh, re rolls for the ones, of which there were two. Nothing on the re rolls. So total damage from the dogs is four points of damage. Nice. Then we have the two units of warriors in the front there. They have 12 dice each, so. We'll just add four to the pool. And they're hitting on fours. Slightly below average this time. And then fives. Oh yeah, fives for your warriors. Yeah. Uh, three. Three more. Seven. Seven. Okay, what's their uh, nerve? Ten, seventeen. Do you want another unit of warriors to go? Oh, no, no it's it's they're just double the attacks. So ten, seventeen, they're on seven damage. So we need three to waver. No, no they are fifteen, seventeen. Fifteen, seventeen. Yeah. So eight to waver, ten to break. Mm -hmm. And again. Oh no, that's only break. Eight to plus seven, break. fifteen. Yep, so What's their break point? 17. Okay, because you get uh, get plus one because the horn blow is there. So uh, they're still a waiver. Okay. Because um, yeah, you only roll inspiring. Yes. If it's a break. A break. Mm -hmm. well, we'll right. On to the next attack. Oh, I should have put in there. Six, eight, well. ten. Oh, he's well in two. Within six. So that's not a waiver. Is it not? No, because he's got rally in two, yeah. which adds to my waiver and route value. So right, so what's your waiver now then? 17, 19. 17, 16. Because you've got an eight, yeah. nine with him. Nine and sevens. 16. 16. Oh, yeah, so yeah. No so waiver. No, not waiver. Not waiver. No, because they're 17. Okay. Uh, mm. The Warriors against the uh, board. Defense far four for these. Uh, three wins. And then the Bane Chanted Fanatics. Is that three, three wins? Yeah. Uh, get 15 attacks. Three, four, five. Three, four, five. Three, four, five. And these are hitting on threes. Ooh. And then they're crushing two. So three and three. Oh, three and two. Yeah, because it's very well. Oh dear. <laughs> Oh dear. That's still not bad though. What, six? <laughs> Two's. Um, six. 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 Nine. Or oh, they are 22, 24. Oh, they're okay as well. <laughs> so, uh, a bounce on all of those, which we'll do shortly. Yep. Uh, the dogs. So the war dogs are 20 dice, so take four away. Hitting on fours. So the uh, dogs needing fours. <laughs> Gotta love it. <laughs> um, what's your, what's your yeah, uh, five. defense five? Yeah. Five re rolling ones. Uh, that is four. four points of damage. Um, okay. So which of these they have got are... Iron Resolve? Well, don't you need to are they, are these have got Iron no, Resolve? No. Neither. No. Okay. Oh no, Triari I have, so they yeah. lose one. So they, so they lose one. To six. If we double six? Nope. Nope. So they go down to three. Yep. And the chariots, which are Bane Charters, they're Thunderous two, Thunderous three, because of the fact that um, they're Bane Chanted. 
well, yeah, effectively just crush. Yeah. But I've not got phalanx, so. Okay, so hitting on fours with eight dice. Need an above average roll here, guys. And we get one. <laughs> you only on a two. One though. damage. Uh, do you want, so they are uh, 14, 16. Uh, 11, not enough. Right, so uh, we'll do some bounces and it's over to the Romans. Okay, so with the end of uh, the Roman move, we have a uh, hindered charge from the cavalry into the rough ground here. Other than that, uh, the bolt throwers have uh, retreated back, allowing the Praetorians to hit the dogs. That uh, should be a messy encounter. <laughs> um, we then have uh, the units re-engaging with now the extra horde engaging against the warriors over there. And then the um, dogs and chariots have been re-engaged over on the far side. So uh, shooting face, it's just the uh, catapult. catapult. Bit into these guys? Yep, yeah, into the cav. It's just so the bottom of your screen. Hit on a five. Uh, oh. Nope. Nice. That's uh, the That's end of the shooting phase. So into combat. So if we start over in yeah. this corner. So hinder charge. So I lose my thunderous. Mm -hmm. But it is still 16 attacks. Okay, hitting on. Five threes. Threes. With a leap. Okay. Well, obviously. <laughs> <laughs> so three, three rolling ones. <laughs> That's a lot. <laughs> okay, fours. <laughs> Two, four, six, eight. Six, eight. Uh, five to waver, seven to break. Seven, they are destroyed. I uh, don't know what happens now. Uh, you can overrun or you can stay where you are. They're going back D3. Uh, three, three inches. Okay. These guys. Against the dogs. Oh yeah, against the dogs. <laughs> Two, four, six, eight attacks. Yep. And on threes. Okay. Rerolling the ones. Uh, defense two. Uh, in people ones. Well, yeah. Because I'm pushing on Thunder Swan, so. Four damage. I might even survive four, this. Four damage. <laughs> four to waver, eight to break. Seven. Uh, so they wavered. And that was seven damage, wasn't it? Yes. Okay. So the regiment of Triarii into your warriors. Five, ten, fifteen. Yeah. Well, these don't have elite, so you're alright. Okay. <laughs> uh, they're still getting off these, though. Okay. <laughs> Diff falls. Mm -hmm. That's horrible. I might have to change dice. Three, six, seven, eight. Eight. Okay, um, that is five and seven. I've got a five. Uh, that is a waiver. So they're waving as well. A lot of attacks now. Uh, yeah, so, so the horde of normal warriors hitting on fours, mm -hmm. but I can reroll five because I've only got 20 dice. So okay. Anyway.
Twos. Twos? Oh, they are uh, naked, naked fanatics. Mm -hmm. Two, four, six, eight, nine. Okay, that is uh, nine to break. Oh, no oh, waiver. So close. Okay. So it was nine to break, so it was seven damage you caused. And then the heavy warriors yep. on that unit, hitting on threes. Yep. I'm going to re re-roll in five of these. Fours. Three, six, seven, eight. Okay. Um, that is seven to break. Six oh, that's a waiver. Oh, not enough. Not enough. Oh, this one's going to be horrible. <laughs> <laughs> 30 attacks hitting all threes on the dogs. <laughs> okay. <laughs> So they're gonna pivot. Okay. And then the cavalry. Cavalry. Sixteen attacks. Hitting all trees with a leap. Defensible. I don't get my thunder swan door. No. Uh, five. Five. You need eight twice. Is it twice? Yeah, it's within 12. Very inspiring. Uh, okay, six plus five is a waiver. Okay, it's a very effective turn in the fact that you've managed to waiver pretty much everything, uh, but you have only de deleted two of my units. Um, however, it is now Kelp turn three. Yep. Resolve. Okay, so um, yeah, pretty much uh, done. Um, so we've got some magic and stuff. So uh, he's gonna fire his bow at that unit. Uh, hits. Yep. Five. Put the oh, wait, that on the heavy warriors. Yeah. yeah. Just twice. Uh, no. No. So. They've got I resolve, haven't yeah. they? Uh, no, heavy warriors, haven't they? Oh, okay, so one, got one, damage. one point of damage. Um, hmm. So we are going to cast uh, Bane Chant on one of the units of warriors. Yep. Doesn't go off. And we're going to cast Bane Chant on the Fanatics. It does go off. So, Bane Chant on Fanatics. Right, okay, so we're going to start over here. We've got uh, some Warriors in the flank. So that's 24 attacks. 5, 10, 20, 24. Hitting on 4s, wounding on 5s. Five, five. Uh, that 
is four damage. Five. Five. Okay. Five, five damage. damage on them. And then we have a troop of fanatics, which is ten dice. Four, five, three, four, five. Open on threes. And uh, crushing one. Fours. And uh, two more. more. There's more seven. And they are 11, 30, oh no, they're 14, 16. Not enough. So they'll have Iron Resolve, take it? Nope. nope. It's only the Triarii okay. that have got Iron Resolve. Um, On to the Chariot. So your lot have got... Um, phalanx. Phalanx. So lose all my Thunderous. Um, so... Yeah. They are 22, 24. <laughs> <laughs> uh, going for the double six, didn't work. <laughs> okay, we have cover against your Praetorians. Yep. Uh, seven attacks. Hitting on fours. That's only two hits. Thunderous one. Fours. Nothing. So they bounce. Uh, warriors. Against the blue unit there. Yep. Ice. <sighs> Oh, seven because of the uh, on seven, so I put them at fourteen. So nine off. Okay. So regain our health. Uh, Bane chanted fanatics. Yep. Into the normal warriors. Yep. Six, seven. Uh, the hero has gone in as well. Three attacks. We elite. Hitting on three, three rolling ones. And uh, he's crushing one. So he Two more. Two more. So that's 18, and I am 22, 24. So six. Five is a waiver. Oh, plus one. Six. So six. Is that enough? Yep. So and again, because he's fine. Got they there. Gone. They're hot. They are destroyed. Oh, that's a big hole now. Um, Fanatics will go D6 forward. Two. And he'll just realize. Here, two lots of warriors, need Rebane chanted, so eight, twelve, four, eight, twelve, fours, and then five, five. Jeremy's gone in as well. Oh, yeah, I forgot about that. Two hits. One more. Pitting on eight. 24, 26. Six, not enough. Both bounce. All, all of them bounce. And I think that is me done. 
I'm a vengeance as well. So that is the end of my turn. Uh, Roman turn, which will be turn, turn two. Yeah. Yeah, because you come at me mm-hmm. high. Yep. I've got another shot here on the dogs. Yeah. So um, Romans have counter charged back in in most locations. Um, the gap has been filled by the Praetorians who have charged onto the Fanatics. Other than that, everything else is fairly standard, including the Onager missing again. <laughs> so we've just got one. Yeah, one bolt one thrower bolt. into the docks. Hit on five. Yep. Yeah. Nope. Nope. And the Roman artillery really failing to impress. Uh, so, over to the combat. So, yes. the uh, Praetorian cavalry have counter charged against the warriors. Hitting on threes with elite. Come on, twos. I've got two of them. Okay. Uh, I don't have my thunderous though. Okay, so fours. Three, six, seven. Seven, uh, eight required. Oh, got it. <sighs> the warriors die at the first attempt. <laughs> and then they're going to reform to face the fanatics. Okay. And then all the players going to get there. Uh, the poor chariots are next to uh, <laughs> suffer the same fate. So this is 30 attacks hitting on threes with elite. Oh no, these don't have elite. Twos, isn't it? Twos, yeah, yeah. That is three, six, nine, twelve. Twelve. Plus seven is nineteen. That is enough for double one zone. Double one. 
Is your hero inspiring? Uh, yes, he is. Double one twice. Hmm. Once. Twice. Nah, they're doing well. Naked warriors are dead. <laughs> um, so then we'll go with the heavy warriors. Plus five, hit not please. for the win yeah <laughs> and then this this plus 10 for these guys yeah Okay, so um, the horde of troops has uh, turned to face the cav. Uh, got a couple of counter charges in the middle and uh, reform there. And then over on this side, the Roman heroes join the battle. Um, the chariots have been counter charged. Okay, so uh, shooting. So we've got four shots yep. on the dogs. Okay. Getting on fives. Yep. Uh, nothing. Still nothing. Okay. <laughs> oh God, I've spent so many points on shooting. <laughs> uh, one shot from the catapult onto these. Yep. On a five. Oh, God. That's okay. what I'm shooting. <laughs> uh, combat. Combat. Uh, so we start down here with the ongoing battle between the yep. ineffective Praetorians and the <laughs> Celtic cavalry. So hitting on three. Yes. Four. So threes. Four. Uh, it takes them up to five damage. Uh, you need an eight to break them. Seven, it's a waiver. <clears throat> and then we've got Praetorian Guard. Yep. On threes. Or not? No. No. And what? On the front. No, they don't on front, yeah. 
Uh, so he's got three attacks, mm -hmm. hitting on threes. Yep. That is crush one, so three. threes. Nothing. Okay. And then this plus ten. Yep. Mm. Oh. That's double ones then. And again. Wow. Oh, that'll stay there. Okay. Uh, Cover against chariots. Yep. Oh, I thought you did wounds last turn, didn't you? Yes, I did, yeah. Threes. So the cavalry have skirted round the uh, horde. Uh, fanatics have just walked back a little bit, um, putting them in a situation where if they turn, they're going to get a rear charge of the fanatics. And if they don't, the cavalry will be back at them. Uh, over here, the dogs have charged in, trying to save the wavered cavalry. Uh, Bane chanted warriors into the Praetorians, which are healthy. And the lord and warriors going back in. And obviously the chariots are wavered, so not a lot to happen in uh, this turn for the Celts. Oh, you've put some more wounds on with your jar of oil. Yeah, my jar of oil, yeah. Oh, um, you need to roll for that. Dip. Oh, yeah. Oh, I'm taking it up. Um, the uh, cavalry notes, it's the dogs. Yep. So the dogs get 20 attacks. Six. Eight. You can't shoot if you're wavered. Ten. No. Ten, two, four, six, eight, ten. Okay, so the dogs are hitting on fours, but they are crushing one versus cavalry. So fours and fours. Fours and fours. Looking good. Ambitious. Two, four, six, eight, nine. Nine. They are eleven, thirteen. And not them? Nine. No. Got. So I've run him over there. <laughs> yeah. Um, uh, Docks will turn. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, to be fair, they deserve it. They've not shot anything all game. <laughs> Down here against Praetorians. Yep. Defense five. So it's fours. Uh, three. Fish for a double six. Nope, nope. So down to two because they've got iron resolve. Yeah, because they'd have been 17, 19. And <sighs> Warriors against yep. the uh, Yellow Brigade. Yep. <laughs> okay, so uh, turn five for the uh, Romans, and uh, they've uh, taken the bait with my cunning plan. <laughs> <laughs> and that's the state of play, basically. Okay, so uh, a couple of scorpion shots. So First one. One into the dogs. One into the dogs. Missed again. <sighs> one into the calf. 
Oh. Missed again. <laughs> oh, God. Uh, that's that, so combats. Okay, so uh, no combat there, so we've just got the Praetorians over here. Yep. Okay, so uh, Praetorians gone? Yeah, they did three. Three? Yeah. <laughs> Seven. Okay. So they... Uh, you need eight, twice. Twice, done a bear. Uh, oh, God. <laughs> That's not what I needed. Okay. And then the... Uh, little hero. Oh, yeah. Maybe he's uh, three attacks. Little, little Johnny Five. In my back. <laughs> Sneaky little crap. <laughs> no, please. Okay. Wounded on three. three. He's got crush one. Three. three damage. Okay. Double six. Nope. Nope. And the calf. Hitting on threes. And then fours. Mm -hmm. No, that's still enough, I think. We got six. Six, twelve. Um, yep, the one twice. Ooh, once. Twice. And there you go. That's the chariot's destroyed. And I will pivot. Okay. Um, let's be done. Over to your six. Oh no, you forgot the uh, general against my honest. Oh, I did. Uh, yeah. So he's got four attacks, mm -hmm. hitting on threes. Yep. Uh, he's got crush one. Okay. Uh, on current player, uh, defense four. So threes, two. And he's 9 11, so you need 9 to break. Yep. Nope. Two damage. <sighs> okay. Pivot. Dogs in there, it's that one. Cavalry against that one. Finally. <laughs> I didn't want to commit to it. Go in there. There's your um, trumpeteer going back in. Static bearer. Is there anything other than one attack again? <laughs> no, there's still only one attack in there. Um, I mean, you can put him in there. It's one extra attack. Yeah, uh, why not? <laughs> Just chucking everyone into yeah. combat. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Part of me drew it, so I'm more a bank champ. Yeah. <laughs> it's just after me, everything is in combat. <laughs> okay. Right. Let's just do this. The Celts are going down fighting me. <laughs> uh, fanatics. Not bad. Uh, defense five, so fours. Yeah. Two. Two. Looking for double six. Give me a waiver. No. It's all right, it's the other one. It's all right. I can handle it. <laughs> um, Alright, cavalry. Six, seven. Three, six, seven. Three, six, seven. <laughs> oh, yeah, actually, that's a point. Let's take you in first. <laughs> you never know. Four, it, would, seven. it would have made them. Um, 
11, 13. Uh, fours. <laughs> <laughs> okay, no hits. <laughs> okay, let's go back to uh, what we wanted to do, which is kill the Scorpios. Yep. Defense four. Uh, da, 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 da. Yep. Three, six, seven, eight. Eight, and they are 11, 13. And against twice. I was hoping you'd not do it. <laughs> and the dogs. Just bounce off a Scorpio. <laughs> uh, 30 attacks. 30 attacks. Pause. Pause and pause. Yeah. Well, that was rubbish. <laughs> I mean, you don't need a lot of this to kill. Six. Yeah. So again, he's 11, 13. Scorpio. Yeah, that's alright. I mean, I've got no combat, so I can't charge the ban. No. Um, you won't be able to shoot either, so. <laughs> that was this one. We know right. how to shoot the Curry, uh, Karinx Warrior, hit on yep. four. Hits. Wounding on five. Wounds. <laughs> I see it. <laughs> I've got the bane charge to that now. Uh, yeah, I knew that's where they were going anyway. Yeah, exactly. It's the only option. Uh, three, six, nine, and ten. Fours and fours. Oh, twelve even. Seven plus seven. Fourteen. Fourteen, fifteen with the blower. Not a waiver. But however, I do tick down one. I still can't believe the guy waving a massive trumpet to the wind. Uh, the cavalry. Uh, Thunderous one. Uh, yep. Yeah. Are you deep? Sorry, fours. Uh, one. Puts me on two. Hero. Uh, one. Puts me on three. Uh, crushing one. So, fours. No, no, no. Uh, looking for double six. No. Oh, I'm a Oh, yeah, yeah. Nope, missed. Uh, the all important one. <laughs> you can get rid of the cow or not. Yeah. I mean, I'm. I've got five on me, so there's still a ball. Ish. They're five, aren't they? Yeah. Pick me on six. Ten? Sixteen? Sixteen. Mm, waver. Waver, that boot. I'll take that. <sighs> Hit your next turn. Right, you're six. Okay. Uh, yeah, we've done that, do we? Yeah, yeah. Five, six. So they're going back in. Yep. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> they're going back in to the unit. Yeah. Oh, they're doing nothing. However, he's going back in. <laughs> oh, um, oh, I don't know if to charge these or to charge him. No, 
let's get rid of your druid. Okay. Pointing up my horse. Alright. Uh, no shooting. So. Uh, yeah. No, because he took damage. No, I didn't. Not off the dogs. You whiffed it with the dogs, so you killed no, this one. No, he did damage, you just did wound him. Did you do damage? Yeah. <laughs> it was 30 attacks. <laughs> did damage. Did like six wounds or something. Oh. Just didn't break them. Didn't mark it. <laughs> um, wow, what's he doing? He old eagle. Don't roll that badly. Eagle, <laughs> eagle bearer. Send him in. Oh, I might do it to be fair. Yeah, they're not that great, mate. He gets one, he gets one attack hitting on a force. So yeah, he might, he might exactly. do something. Right, starting over here. Yeah, so this plus 10. Okay. Hit yeah, on threes. Two. Uh, double one. one. Twenty-two. Three. Six. Nine. Double one. <laughs> <laughs> <Go> on. <laughs> Come on. No. Bounce. 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 No. Bounce. How much was it? Twenty-two. <laughs> oh, whatever. <laughs> no. Okay. General on a horse. <laughs> okay. I'm just going to forget that happened. Uh, hit on threes. Oh no. Can we kind of kill a druid yeah. now? Crush one. Yeah. <laughs> Nothing. <laughs> Bounce. <laughs> oh no. Okay. Come on. Come on, Roman. You've nearly done it. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> uh, hit on threes. We're in our fours. Yeah. Four, eight, nine. Nine, double one. Twice. Whoops. Twice. Oh. And then the horse back into the horses on threes. Yep. Fours. Uh, yeah. Four. Four. Yeah. Okay. Uh, nine plus four, thirteen. And again. Yeah. Uh, come. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So then the almighty three attacks from the hero. Yeah. The threes. Yeah. <laughs> Don't take them down. <laughs> <laughs> Crush ones to threes. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Three more. Uh, six. Okay. Standard um, bearer. Oh, he hits. Yeah. He is nothing, so fours. <laughs> so they're on seven. So seven. Uh, you need eight. No. Oh. Uh, six is a waiver. <laughs> <laughs> Take that. Uh, okay. So <laughs> six on nine damage in total. Uh, seven. Seven yeah. damage. Yeah. Yeah. Then another waiver. Uh, roll for seven. Uh, right. Okay. So uh, we rolled for turn seven, and Sam had the opportunity to uh, roll the dice and rolled a massive one. Yeah. So no turn seven. So at the end of turn six, the battlefield. Um, was pretty much as it was um, throughout the whole game. So the Celts took the advantage, one first turn, rushed forward into the Roman ranks, yeah. uh, just threw bodies at the Romans, bounced, bounced off, <laughs> threw more bodies at the Romans, bounced, bounced <laughs> threw more uh, bodies at the Romans. Uh, finally, by about turn four, did actually start to kill some Romans. Um, yeah. 
and at the end of the score, um, I think basically the the uh, Celtic general was simply better. <laughs> no, 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 no. And had and had played the scenario rather than just went trying to kill Celts. So um, managed to break <laughs> through the lines of the Romans. Uh, managed to get my dogs pretty much. Well, my dogs were even in his deployment zone. Um, my fanatics held up that entire horde. The only thing I couldn't have ignored them. No, you couldn't have ignored them, no, in fairness. I just should have done more damage um, to them. <laughs> but yeah, so uh, my, my very uh, weak, but... Uh, one more turn, though. One more turn, I would have had you. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I would have done. You wouldn't. Yeah, I would. No <laughs> way. Double charge with the cab into there, would have popped them. No. Yeah, those two into the back, would have popped them. No. Yeah, defo. No, they're only on three. No, I'm into these. <laughs> they're only on six. <laughs> yeah, but they're only a regiment. Yeah. No, you're right. It's valid. You're right, but I mean, no, it doesn't matter because there wasn't extra, them. There wasn't an extra turn. Just scenario wise. There wasn't an extra turn. No, but the scenario was decided right at the start. You'd have kept that little play. The, the, <laughs> the, the scenario was decided at the start. So, um. Obviously, so when it says the entire unit has to be in the enemy half, that means the entire unit, Sam. Which How one? many points did you score, Sam? <laughs> How many? Come on. Come on, the audience is waiting. <clears throat> They've sat through all of this. They want to know. I killed more than you did. How many points did you score from the scenario? None. Zero. Zero. So all these Celts that die, doesn't matter, because I'll just, I'll just get more. And how many did the Celts score? Was it five? No. Was it five? <laughs> yeah, so five nil to the Celts. Uh, Unbelievable. I know, but yes, there we are. That's uh, that's Sam who can literally, um, you know, drag defeat out of the uh, grasp of victory. <laughs> yeah, that's how it's done, right? <laughs> <laughs> anyway, so I hope you enjoyed that. Do check out Kings War Historical. Um, I'm, I'm sure you can find copies of it somewhere. If not, um, check out Easy Army. It's on there still uh, for as long as Mantic don't pull it down and stick it on their chargeable thing. Yeah, I know. Yeah. What are you falling out with them over that? Right, so anyway, I hope you enjoyed that. Do so like, subscribe, and we'll bring you some more sort of weird and wonderful games uh, very soon. Uh, thanks again to Sam for uh, taking part. So we'll see you soon. Bye-bye.